Let's get the list. Hey, you know we are uh, we're entering the fall season. Oh yeah, uh, favorite season of a lot of people. Mm -hmm. and, and I like the fall too. I, I do too. But I think there are a, a lot of overrated things about the sure, fall. So yeah, my list right. today is. Uh, most overrated things about the fall. I left off by default pumpkin spice because sure. yeah, we all know a, yeah. Yeah, yeah, enough yeah. is enough. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Um, but first up, number one on my list, um, apple picking. Yeah, 100%. Never really uh, understood the concept myself. I mean, I, I, I should take that back. There is one place that I do I do love to go for apple picking. All right. It's this place, it's called uh, Jewel Osco. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> easy to reach. They have every kind of apple, but people go apple picking, they get these pipe dreams yeah. that they're gonna, they're gonna get a bushel of apple, oh, we're gonna make a pie, mm -hmm. we're gonna make crisps, yeah. we're gonna make sauce, right. we're gonna, and you end up with one pie and two dozen rotten apples. Yes. yes. And, but, but big shout out to all you apple orchards out there. Yeah. Hope you're having a bang up season yeah. this year. Yeah, we do. We wish I won't you the be best. There for myself. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, next up, Robin, you may not like this one, but very overrated, layering. Oh, yeah. Oh, I couldn't disagree more. You love the light. Listen, you know what I'm going to do when I leave here today? I'm going to go home. I'm going to throw on a t-shirt yep. yep. and a pair of shorts, yep. and I'm going to be on my way yep. with the rest of my day. I don't have to worry about picking out three different types of clothes yeah. to wear. You got textures. I, I like to layer. Yeah. Like it's my best season. I like to layer. I like to do a shirt and a vest and a sweater and a jacket. It's, it's, it's enough. Yeah. It's enough with the clothes. You never know when you might get a little chilled, so you want to have a jacket to go over the sweater. And oh God, fall clothes are just the no, best. No, I get why you do it. I just oh, think it's completely it. overrated. Give yeah. me a t-shirt and jeans <laughs> and let me just live my life. <laughs> yep. Uh, next up, uh, this is kind of a, a one or a two. Campfire or a fire pit? I agree. People love being around. Here's the problem with campfires and fire, uh, fire pits. It's body temperature regulation. Oh, yeah. You get too close. Yeah. All yeah. of a sudden, you're hot. If it's nice for like 30, then you're hot. Then you got to yeah. move back. Then you yeah. move back. And then guess what happens? Yeah. yeah. You, gotta you get cold. cold. Yeah. You got to move back again. We and need then to the find, smoke. And yeah. then the smoke. And yeah. then you yeah. never get that smell out of your clothes. You need clothes. to find a way to get the fire to be a little bit cooler, a little bit more right. room temperature. You got to find a way if you could put a thermostat on a fire pit or a campfire. Yeah. I think and then now we're in business. You got to worry about putting it out. Right. It's a, it's not easy. No. If you go gas. You put though, out a lot of campfires. If you go I know. gas, though, you kind of get a little bit of both worlds, right? You get the atmosphere and you kind of, you know. A little bit, yeah. But I know it's not authentic. Well, you gotta poke holes in there. <laughs> Can you just Dan. let me vent? Mm, that's you your choice. trying to come up with this a compromise. Uh, next up, up uh, leaves changing colors. <laughs> okay? <laughs> But it's like, let's go see. It lasts like five days. Yeah. Yep. And then you know what happens? They all turn, <laughs> they all turn dead brown yeah. and land on my front lawn. Yeah. And in my gutters. Yeah. And, ah, it's so pretty. And then three weeks later, I'm yeah. on a ladder picking yeah. out wet leaves out of my gutter. Yeah. Leaves suck. Yeah. I don't and, like them. And at all, all the road trips to see the change in uh, colors. Yeah, yeah. Everybody, everybody says that every year. We're going to take a trip and see the colors. No, you're not. Get it out of your head now. You're not going to do it. You're too busy. Your kids got soccer. One of them's yeah. got right, football. Right. You're not driving down to no. Galena no. or right. where, wherever no. to see yeah. colors. No. Uh, <laughs> next up, uh, seasonal beer. It's a, it's enough with the, with the pumpkin <laughs> lagers and the special IPAs and the Halloween. You know, it, it gets out of control. The yeah. chocolate. Let's just give me a beer. Right. Can no. I just have a regular beer? Right. That's it. All right. Yeah. Uh, next up. Also going to be a very unpopular selection. Halloween. I agree. It's enough. <laughs> you know, it's a time for kids to get candy. And I see these people uh, uh, spending thousands of dollars decorating their front lawns. Yeah. It's like cool it a little bit. You know, yeah. and people say, oh, well, well, you know, people go overboard for Christmas. Yeah. You know, what's the difference? Listen, I'm not sure, you know, I know not everybody believes it, but Christmas is different. You're talking yeah. about a guy who a lot of people think is the savior of the world. Right. <laughs> right. Halloween is just about kids getting candy. Right. And Satan. Right. <laughs> and Satan. Yeah. Right. Right. We're spending thousands of dollars. Right. On yeah. the devil. Yeah. Doesn't make any sense. You got and now that you have a house. Jesus. 
the amount of pumpkins and stuff you're oh, supposed yeah. to decorate your front porch stop. with. I, the it. seasonal yeah. decor is nah, just... No, you don't have to. I, It'd be nice yeah. if we just all agreed, let's go to the Target, buy a bag of candy, give it to our kids. Right, and but you one get pumpkin, the whole bag. Right. You tell me which family. kind you want. Here, here it is. Here's uh, yeah. your full bag. There's 50 Poor pieces. Kelly. Look at her. Let's sit down and be no quiet. all of us. Yeah. Yeah. No yeah, joy. No like no, just such a joy. Just save a lot of money, <laughs> but all this uh, extra he stuff. He is a little, but we'll we'll yeah. get to him. Uh, last one. Uh, listen, I, I got to be honest. Bears football. Oh. Not that I don't love watching the Bears, and I don't. This I got to be. I got to yeah, be you, clear how I preface this. All right. Here's why it's overrated. Okay. Because we're all excited for it. We're all, you know, every Sunday by mid-November. Everybody in this room is saying, God, I can't wait to have my Sundays back because <laughs> yeah. this team yeah. is terrible. Yeah. Maybe that'll be different this year. Yeah. I, hope I'm, I hope I'm proven wrong. Right. But for the last couple of years, it hurts. very Many overrated. Years. I get very excited. Yeah. And then, yeah. like, Hopeful. five games in, I'm like, God, I got to spend three hours watching yeah. this team on Sunday. Yeah. yeah. You know. It hurts. Yeah. So there you go. There's the list. That's okay. a great one. list. Yeah. Yeah. overrated. Yeah. Good list. Thank you. Yep. Kind of keeps on that theme of being optimistic and cheerful. Yeah. yeah. Right? <laughs> on brand.